a vaccination appointment? Yes, I'm going for vaccination this Saturday. I'm so excited. Hi guys, do you guys know how science saves millions of lives during this COVID-19 pandemic? Do you guys know why should we go for vaccination? Well, vaccine is a dead or weak virus. When vaccine is injected into our body, our body immune system is stimulated and will produce specific antibody to fight against the virus and create antibody producing memory cells. When our body are exposed to the same pathogens again, our body will react more faster and more effective towards the viruses. viruses. Now, what about our ecosystem? In vitro fertilization helps in animal breeding. IVF has been using in producing cows, horses, and even bringing back the endangered white reno. Besides, breeding in captivity such as wildlife reserves and zoos is used to preserve endangered species such as turtle and panda. Forest fire monitoring is carried out by remote sensing. This process involves satellite, for example, NASA satellite. Have you wondered why all the fruits we eat are fresh and juicy? Fruits are related to agriculture, and agriculture is related to science. Some of the fruits and vegetables that we eat daily are produced through tissue culture. For example, tomato and carrot. Tissue culture can produce mature plants very quickly and reduce the chance of transmitting diseases. Another question is how to maintain the freshness of the food. One of the methods is using gamma rays to carry out food irradiation to kill the bacteria on the food. Now, what about the water we drink? Yes, science uses filtration, ultraviolet treatment and fluoridation to preserve the water. Wow, this weather is so hot. Ah. Well, this is caused by climate change and this leads us back to the greenhouse effect. This situation is caused by power plants, vehicles and food waste producing greenhouse gases that trap heat in the atmosphere and thus increasing the earth temperature. Don't worry though, science has a solution. Science discovered solar energy, wind energy and wave energy to replace fossil fuels and coal. Besides that, we have hybrid cars and electric cars to supplant traditional cars. Amazing, right? Well, there's more. With the knowledge of science, scientists use animal waste to create biofuel, yet another energy source. Lastly, scientists discover Adionella sakaiensis, a plastic-eating bacteria capable of solving Earth's plastic pollution problem. <laughs>